Hi guys and welcome to uh, Traffic Snap uh, Review. So this is a web-based app that allows you to do a lot of uh, cool stuff regarding uh, Twitter, basically getting you traffic uh, from Twitter. So this is what you will see once you have set your set up your account and logged in. Okay, so what you can see here is that you can add your uh, keywords over here and hashtags. And once you've uh, you know click once you click on your keyword. You can see your related posts uh, or you know last posts regarding those uh, keywords. Uh, I had to log in back again. Let me just switch my account over here. Yeah, as you can see, you know once you click here, and uh, it will show you your, the latest posts regarding uh, that keyword or hashtag, and then you can select all or select them uh, individually. And then you can either follow selected or reply to selected. You can also filter them out by tweets only retweets only or replies only and um, on your right uh, hand side here you have the home uh, section where you can see your latest posts the my tweets is I think the same as the home section mentions is uh, when somebody you know, mentions you in a tweet here and when uh, the retweets are uh, the tweet that somebody has posted your own uh, tweet that somebody else has posted your connections followers uh, the stat status uh, updates over here uh, is cool. Of course, you can write anything you want over here, and you can either post now or post it later. Interesting thing here is that you can uh, do both. You can post now and post later. Here, you just select the date and the time and your time zone. You can also upload the image. I would like to have the options here to upload the video and GIF uh, as well, because this is what Twitter allows you to do when you are actually on Twitter logged in on your account or here of course you can see your recent tweets and scheduled tweets I have none uh, so far uh, so I want to show you the campaigns over here you can name your campaign uh, select your uh, Twitter uh, account over here uh, the start and the end time the post interval can be set from uh, one hour to I guess how many hours you want and you can uh, add your uh, keywords and hashtags over here one below the other. Okay, so what the campaigns basically allows you to do, uh, there's like a part missing here. I think they're doing some updates right now, so it's missing. You can add your, uh, you know, keywords and hashtags and your uh, RSS feeds and YouTube channel URLs, and it will like uh, post, uh, uh, you know, related content uh, on your Twitter. I'm not sure how much I like this because I have no idea what. Uh, you know the software uh, with the app will be posting um, I definitely would like to see some more adjustments here uh, for you to be able to better choose you know which kind of content is being posted on your Twitter account so this will basically serve as a content curator what we have next here is the auto reply section which is uh, cool I think it can be used uh, uh, in a very good way but you do have to be a little bit uh, cautious when using this not to spam people so you enter your keywords and hashtags over here to monitor and you can enter your start and end time here and posting interval in uh, hours and then you have uh, three uh, reply options when somebody when the software you know um, so when the software uh, you know finds a relevant uh, keyword or a hashtag you entered it will post uh, uh, one of these replies that you have uh, uh, put here. I'm not sure uh, how this works. Does it, you know, randomly shuffle these replies? But I would definitely like to see more, uh, you know, adjustment options here so that, for example, you have a reply for a specific uh, keyword or hashtag and basically just, you know, infinite uh, replies uh, over here to, uh, to set up, you know, because like this, I'm not sure how it will be posting and, you know, it can be very spammy if you're not careful. Uh, it could be a good uh, useful tool if you you know just uh, share something valuable and you know just not uh, spam people uh, in your every post so this is what uh, it basically does uh, hope you you know like this uh, review and I'll see you next time bye bye oh and sorry uh, one thing I forgot is that um, these are the basically options that you will have for purchasing you have traffic snap personal which is $17 traffic snap elite 27 then you have the professional which is 47 this is the downsell here uh, traffic snap ace 27 uh, honestly I have no idea uh, the differences between these uh, versions here 
I'm guessing that the personal is just for, uh, I don't know, I guess one account, one Twitter account in Elite is like multiple accounts, then the agency is for, you know, clients, accounts and so on. And probably here are some differences in features, but I still haven't been able to get the answer uh, from the vendor regarding the differences between these uh, uh, different types. So I just want to show you the, the funnel over here. Okay, that's it for this review. Hope you liked it and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.